Hello my lovely Scorpio, welcome to my channel Kasha Tarot, this will be your reading for a month of April, I hope everyone is fine, let's see what our Scorpio what awaits you in month of April, this will be general reading and just bear in mind it won't resonate with everyone, uh, this is definitely this is message for someone not for all of you but just let's have a look let's have a look i will just check my mic is working month of april for scorpio oh i can see you already queen of cups Nine of Wands, Five of Wands, The Star, Eight of Swords, There is the Tower, <coughs> There is Five of Pentacles, There is Two of Wands, there is Knight of Pentacles. My dear, dear Scorpio, you, for the month of um, April, you will be in a kind of mental prison. I can't do that. I can do this. I can't do that. I can't move there. I can't move that. You know, I can't do this because you're just putting the stuff, you know, all this what is that woman has on her eyes, you're putting this on yourself, you can easily take it off and move on, but you're not doing that. It's your state, you can be a little bit depressed. Um, it's you in here. And you are this wounded warrior with many hurts after some battles. And there is a, some conflict around you, maybe already, maybe it will start or already started. So there is a, some, some conflict and you're already just tired, wounded, tired of this conflict. I don't know if I will put the clarifiers, but at the moment is there is a conflict. You're thinking about yourself to come out from it because uh, you're just tired of it. You don't want this conflict anymore. There is a tower moment. Tower, tower will, will come and will destroy something what didn't have a foundation. So in a way, tower is a good card because tower will destroy it and remove everything what didn't have any future in a way. And there is a future awaiting you because you have a hope for a future. For, you have your hope for the future. And there is wish fulfillment coming, but it will come when you will take off all this what you have on your eyes, what you don't want to see what is around. You can, you want to be, it's your choice that you are in this mental prison. I can't do this, I can move on, I can't do this enough. You can, uh, in the, during this month, you can feel tired, you can feel exhausted, you are after battle, um... You, you will be in your also energy, Scorpio energy, water energy. We have a Queen of Cups. And you can be filled down. You can feel left out. You, you can feel that some, someone abandoned you. But by the end of April, you will be starting planning for, for a future. And step by step going forward or someone is coming towards you. Maybe, maybe with an apology. Maybe with um, some little gift. Maybe with some message. Someone stable can come towards you or you will be taking like first steps moving on from the energy of pen, five of pentacles because you definitely you can have you can feel very depressed like left out alone lonely and sad um and you are you are in this energy of eight of swords you don't want to take the this, this bandage from your eyes or whatever it's called, this mask, you, you don't want to see, it's your choice. Just remember, all these black thoughts, I can't do this, I can't move there, and it's, it's your choice. It, it, this is what is in your head, okay? But there is a hope. Just don't lose that. There is a hope. Always there is a hope. Don't be too long in this energy of uh, five of pentacles or eight of swords, confused, I don't know what to do, where to go, where to start. 
This will clear out by the end of the month. Let's see Queen of Cups, beautiful Queen of Cups. What's going on with you? Mm, we have Queen of Pentacles. Mm, and we have the High Priestess. Oh, you are very into much into like feelings, emotions. Um, you are more. You are. You are very much with um, with your to in touch with intuition. You are very like deep inside yourself. You are like searching for um, answers in yourself. You very like. You can be doing like a meditation or whatever you are interested in. You really like very much with the I don't know spirit realm you can be at the beginning of the month you will be like very within looking for the answers and and within in a spiritual world so you can example start going to church you can fast you can meditate you can whatever is necessary to do and you will be in very feminine energy you will be you will be full of emotions and you will there, there will be this energy also of the mother of the caring person someone this is you. This will be you. Will be in this energy, really lovely energy, really nice, feminine, like proper spiritual feminine energy. But you are you are wounded. Why are you wounded? Or there is a woman, or there was a, is a woman around you who who will be like kind of guidance for you. But I think you will be guidance for yourself by yourself and for yourself if you only go within to the spiritual realm why are you wounded what's happened scorpio your home you want this four of wands decision someone from the past and you blocking i don't know what you're blocking but for me it's like um there was decision that you wanted to start you know, you wanted to have a happy home, celebrate, but because of some decision, you can do that. And you are tired of trying and trying to build this home, this happy homes. And now you just will be blocking everyone. You will be just stay away from me. I tried my best. I wanted my best. Didn't happen. I'm blocking you off. Why is the conflict there? Maybe something regarding family, maybe something regarding property. Um, you can be wounded, you like you feel like you may be lost, but you didn't. You just wounded the soldier, warrior. You didn't, uh, you didn't lost, but you can feel very tired and overwhelmed with the situation. Maybe regarding home, but it's regarding mostly home. Something to do with home. So maybe with the family, maybe someone should return, didn't return, or something like that. But I see a lot of like feminine energy around. What's the conflict? The conflict is within you. We have the fool and you. Well, you're scared to start new. You're scared. You have like uh, you don't want to start new. You you want to you want to have your home and the situation with in what you wear. You don't want to. You are scared. You have a uh, anxiety um, because you don't want to start new. You are afraid of starting new. This is a conflict within you. There is the, I don't see the conflict with other people. Maybe, but mostly you are conflicted. Start. What do you want to tell Scorpio? Uh, I see lots of feminine feminine energy. We have the Empress in here on a star. But the other thing is, because you are a Queen of Cups, and regarding this conflict, it can it could also be conflict with the King of Cups, or also Water Sun, or your spouse, or someone from your family, some no family, husband, boyfriend, long term relationship. Uh, you you maybe you arguing. You don't know, you, you know about. How you see the future together? How do you see home? This will be the issue. You can be conflicted with them. 
But I see lots of, very lots of strong feminine energy. You tell me, Scorpio. Tell me what is this Eight of Swords? Why is Eight of Swords? Why are you in a mental... At the Knight of Wands. You're waiting for someone to help you. You you have decision to make regarding someone, someone maybe younger, or be with him, or be with this knight, or be by yourself. Feminine energy, really lots of feminine energy. What the tower will bring? Justice. So it's good because uh, the tower is in here to bring justice to your life. Why five of pen pentacles? Well, five of pentacles because you feel left out. Maybe someone left you. Maybe you waiting for this person to arrive. This knight of swords, what is not very reliable person anyway, and you you are like a mental prison because you know that you have to make a right decision. You don't want to see. You actually know what decision you should make, but you don't want to do it because you are afraid to start new. Um, but you know what decision to choose because you should choose that nine of pentacles. Be by yourself and flourish. But you don't want to. You don't want to make that decision yet. You're waiting for something, and you will be locking yourself in a mental prison. Instead of making a decision and going forward, uh, you will be waiting for this night to arrive. And this night is not good for you anyway, because this night you don't. You will. This is not material for a strong relationship. This can be someone flaky, someone who you can't rely on. And you will be waiting and you, you will be very, very, you will actually in April, you will be very, very attractive, Scorpio. Very attractive, very feminine. If you are female, you will be just blossoming. Even that you will be in not very good mental state, Scorpio. But anyway, you will be now also in a five of pentacles, depressed, left out, feeling lonely, left out by yourself. By the end of April, it will move. Everything, the, the energy will shift. And you will move, you will start planning and slowly, slowly you will be going forward, planning with your life. And this is what you actually have to do. So advice of this card is you are, you can be single, you can be happy being single. You are the empress, you are the high priestess, you are queen of uh, cups and you are the queen of pentacles. You have all this very feminine energy around you and you are this is strong feminine, uh, uh, feminine um, energy. The justice will happen to the person who, who maybe hurt you or the arguments were. And you know that you have to make a decision to not wait for that person. Because you are you I think you will be waiting for this person for their move towards you. But the card says no. Because if you will be waiting for that person, that person is just no. You will feel anyway like this five of pentacles. Left out in a cold by yourself, you have to move forward. You start have to go forward with your life without anyone to be this nine of pentacles. What's the plan for the future? You have to calm yourself. You have to find balance within yourself. And I think you can work on it because we have the high priestess at the beginning of the month. You need to calm yourself um, with your emotions, with your feeling where to go. Just find the balance in your life. Slowly, slowly, nobody telling you if you're grieving someone, if you're not happy, if someone left you, slowly, slowly, don't feel like that for too long, like a five of pentacles, you can move forward, you'll be slowly moving forward in April. And yes, we have this knight of pentacles, someone is coming, it can be earth sign, um, Capricorn, Taurus, uh, Virgo. Uh, or not necessarily, or someone quite slow, but steady. They is coming to you quite slow and steady. And this is someone from your past who misses you. And you misses that person. That person will be coming towards you anyway, but you have to wait. It's very, this, this is the slowest uh, night in a deck. It's coming slow. Just be patient. Be patient, Scorpio. Make a right decision. You know what the, what's, what's the, the right decision is. Um, he is coming to you with the news. He wants to give you some uh, uh, some little pentacle. It's coming towards you, but you just have to uh, be patient, make the right decision, and be firm. We have a king of swords. This is, can be also the uh, um, air sign, someone like um, maybe Aquarius, Gemini, Libra. This is the person who you're waiting for, but it's coming slowly towards you. So uh, the communication with that person, any message, it's coming quite slow. It will be coming uh, slowly towards you. 
So in general, you know what decision you have to make, you don't want to make, you're avoiding to make that decision, you don't know where to go, you still live in a hope waiting for that person to come back, even knowing that that person is not worth it. If you will make a decision to be by yourself and move on, the other knight will be coming towards you, which is a king of swords, a sign, uh, will be coming to you, there is a hope, you just have to come out from the mental prison, make a decision and move on because that another person it will be appearing in your life coming and this person will be stable person not like this uh, uh knight of uh, wands this will be a, a stable very stable person what you can rely on but not yet is coming towards you slowly but first finish with the with one and you know what you have to end you know that you shouldn't wait with, and living in a hope that that person will change, but because that person will not change. So you have to make a decision, take that first step. You are scared. You don't want to start new. You don't want to move on. This is you who doesn't want to move on. Let's see the advice for our Scorpio. Yeah. So the advice is death, the chariot, and stop being moody. Um, death. You have to end it. You end it. You know what to end. And move on. And you will be victorious if you will move on. But you are you can be a little fast. You you can you you will maybe in a head thinking, oh um it's only that person. And I can't move on because I won't find anyone else that's similar. I miss that person. You know what? I don't see much emotionals. I don't see much love there. I just see like more attachment, mental prison. There is no for me in that relationship what you were waiting, what that person was you waiting on. There wasn't love. There wasn't love there. It was more mental prison, more attachment, more I don't know if healthy or unhealthy, I didn't see no healthy. You just, like in a spiritual light, like you're just calling for your soulmate. But this knight of wands, who wasn't your soulmate, he won't come back. Like you want him to come back. You wait for that another person who is coming to you, but you have to cut the tide off. You have to move on now. You don't want to do that. This is the, 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 the biggest step for you to do. You, you you can think, no, there is no one else, I'm missing my path, there is no one else similar. You have to be patient. Just can't saying to be patient, the right person will arrive. I know that it's annoying. That, look, you have, be patient, your wish will be fulfilled. But you just move on with your life. You are nine of pentacles, lots of feminine, get into your feminine energy. Lots of feminine, beautiful energy, feminine energy around you. You just use that and move on. Don't put yourself in mental uh, uh, prison. Don't wait for anybody. Just move on. Focus on yourself. Lots of focus on yourself and move on, Scorpio. This is advice for you for month of April. Please like, share, please comment. And visit me on Sundays, um, 5 p.m. every Sunday live. I'm doing uh, uh, reading for free. You can pop in, just give a question. And if 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 I will have a chance to answer, I'll be answering to most of the questions. Anyway, you take care, Scorpio. Thank you for watching and see you soon. Bye-bye.